what is going on you guys happy friday we are back today with a quick review here of the weekly blog post by marvel strike force uh being wings of fury so a uh, pretty short and sweet update actually uh but we know dark hawk coming in um he's going to likely be the next character here so what's up coming here for the battle plan in terms of happening uh from uh, october 7th to october 13th being in that week we got some war season reward updates so adding some additional uh, rewards for us to boost up our accounts more specifically uh, it's nice to see that gold continually go up to create uh for our accounts as well as we build up that up um we have a uh, rescue blitz um, um, in addition to that, a Season 5 Battle Pass here for Sylvie, giving us more opportunities for shards of her. Uh, we have the Spectral Emporium, uh, the Spending of Enmity Treats, in addition to Spending Power Core. So make sure you guys are saving that up, but uh, I will be making a video actually on the event that's going live today as well. We have this Feral Festival Web Milestone. Uh, we got the 44th Strike Pass featuring the Zombie Iron Man, which is great to see his addition finally coming back. Um, can't believe it's actually been a full year since we last seen him in the game. So um, they have, they really pushed this, uh, and we still don't have any opportunities to actually get shards of him. Dark Hawk's initial release is coming on October 12th, so really looking forward to that. And then we also have the Dark Hunters quick rumble there. So uh, things to be uh, on the watch for. Bucky Barnes uh, joining the raid store in Orbs. Good stuff. Uh, we have Moonstone getting added to the raid store as well. So an opportunity for us to pick up shards for both of them, uh, especially with them having some value in the game, um, especially Bucky Barnes being part of invaders for incursion raids. We got Apocalypse's fifth seven red stars coming to the elite store finally. And then finally uh, as well, Nova's six and seven star also getting added uh, through the way of dark promotion credits. So an opportunity for us to take advantage of. Uh, like I said earlier, he's going to be the next one here joining the Pegasus team. So Darkhawk landing very, very soon. Can't wait to have his unlock. October 12th uh, will be the first time we can utilize Power Cores and as well as his offers coming into the game for his unlock. So Friday Free Claim. Um, this is the Ventral Spirits event. I'm going to have a quick video on this as well, just how to get through it. But uh, make sure you guys are capitalizing. This is going to be a combination of using raids, uh, farming campaign energy, in addition to spending of Power Cores. But uh, for the Friday Free Claim, it does get added here. We got some cat head amulets 100 campaign energy to boost us up and as well vindicator orb fragments that we're going to be constantly farming night of the wear tigress event so uh, again we kind of preluded this earlier but with the spectral emporium uh it is going to be a couple things we're going to be once again farming these uh campaign notes for uh these fragments um it looks like we're going to be using power cores as we see fit uh, and as well, this event store is going to actually have really good rewards here, as we can see, right? Um, so it's going to be an opportunity. I'm assuming what's featured right now, Kestro, Rescue, Aspects of Pegasus. Uh, hopefully, there's some more, uh, you know, Gear 18 materials too, really taking advantage of that. Uh, and there's also going to be actually a leaderboards here for a 7 red of Spider-Man Big Time, uh, who's been quite relevant actually in War, uh, Cosmic Crucible, and even actually in Dark Dimension 6 as a very viable option in those uh, the city nodes. So uh feral festival web milestone something to be on the on, on the watch for here um we're gonna be battling in raid so you know just keep doing what we're doing uh this is gonna be adding to that dark hunters quick rumble alliance war reward update so this is really good stuff here um i always like to see these revisions but it looks like there's actually going to be an opportunity here where yeah doubling the gold top payout up to 20 million um and it's arriving pretty shortly or actually this coming weekend so i think that's gonna be the big noble addition uh we're also gonna be finding more elite war credits so we'll get an opportunity there to actually open up the war orbs some battle pass visual upgrades so it looks like they actually did uh, take a look at this and they're going to be revising that in the short time here uh, just to improve that going forward so that's it guys nothing game breaking just some quick updates here but uh, always great to see some new character additions coming into the raid store uh, I, de I know i definitely will take advantage of that so there you guys have it short and sweet i'll also have another video on the event that's going live as well so thank you as always guys hope you have a great rest of the weekend thank you and i'll catch you guys in the next one